Look around you and count the number of electronic gadgets you own. Your cell phones, smartphones, laptops, desks, tablets, music players, televisions, hi-fi systems, personal Wi-Fi, MiFi, and many more. Notice the use of plural words because that is becoming the reality. You probably did not realize you have that many. Do not worry, it is not just you. Everyone has way more gadgets than they need. Each of the gadget emits some sort of radiation. So is this good for you? For many years, people were asking if the radiation from mobile phones had any effect on humans. However, in the past five years, the discussions in mainstream media seem to have died down. So has the radiation simply gone away? The answer is no. It is still around, and although each device might be emitting less radiation, we are now using more devices. Even though people have stopped talking about it, it is still a problem. Worse of all, the experts still cannot be sure if they are good or bad for humans. Do a search on Google for cell phone radiation effects on human. Look through the first few pages and you will see that the opinion is very divided. Some experts say it causes cancer, can destroy brain cells, increases human reaction time and affects sleeping patterns. However, some experts say that a small amount of radiation can actually improve your health and thinking ability. There are also those that says that the small amount of radiation simply does not make any difference. We could stop using all our electronic devices from now. Alternately, there is a very specific branch of research that is looking into ways to balance the bad radiation that humans absorb from electronic devices. Their aim is to attempt to emit the inverse radiation so that the total balances out. Think of it a plus one plus minus one creates zero. They call the balancing radius positive radiation and the area of research electromagnetic balancing. We do not get anything positive out of it, but at least it neutralizes the negative effects of radiation, which by itself is a big improvement. This is cutting-edge research but at least there is hope. Whether you believe that radiation from electronic gadgets is good or bad for you, it is important that you understand the risks and take adequate measures to protect yourself. It is a real problem that affects everyone.